This is David Birch at Star Pass School of Navigation in Seattle with a note on installing OpenCPN onto a PC computer. Um, process is essentially the same for a Mac, but we'll put a Mac on later. Uh, the Mac has one extra step. But anyway, here you go to OpenCPN.org, then go to the Downloads page, then take the, uh, let's see, latest release is here, and here's Windows, Download. And uh, let me just say, there's some features that work better once you get into at least Windows 7. Uh, XP is, uh, has some limitations, so it's better for a, a newer computer, Windows 10. But this is actually to show the Windows 7, but I don't think that matters between 7 and 10. So then you download that and say save. And then, um, then uh, that's that. Then you can go to the computer. Um, and let's see, I'll go here and go to downloads. And there it is. Uh, well, actually, it looks like I did twice. Well, I did it once actually on XP and discovered that what there were that what there were some limits. Then uh, English language uh, next uh, next. Uh, these are all okay. That'll be little shortcuts and so forth. It goes into standard. Notice going into x86. So even though it's a 64-bit computer, it's a 32-bit program. Next, uh, then all that stuff's okay. All that's okay. All that's okay, and it does it. And this is how, literally, how long it takes. I'm at, yeah. Um, okay, F run, open that, show install log. We don't need that. Let's go ahead and open it. Uh, some uh, um, notes on the licensing, which is that. Okay, and then there is the program coming out. You can make this bigger. I'm just dragging the corners. Uh, cancel that. Uh, okay, so here's the program. So the first thing I just note, and then we're essentially done, but I just want to note that you'll notice when you first install it, the base map is a very crude one. We have other videos that show you how to uh, change this. They have very high resolution bitmaps and compromises there. And then when you're working with the program, you'll have these are some control buttons, but this is your main function up here, this uh, wrench. Everything in a sense starts from the wrench, and that brings open these options that we will uh, discuss shortly. Here, for example, another video show chart downloader. As far as I can tell, you cannot get the chart downloader with the XP version. So you have to do that on your own. So that's, a, that's one of the differences, for example. And uh, so that really is all I want to say for now in this one. It's a very quick, easy process to download that. And then we have other details later.